Welcome back to ETV. Now, we have an astronaut joining us here today on set to help celebrate Space Days going on at the Discovery Center of Idaho. And to tell us a little bit more, because our astronaut's a little on the quiet side, is Doug Lambeth, and he's the marketing director over there. Doug, thanks for joining us. Tell us about Space Days. Well, Space Days is an event that we started at the Discovery Center back in 2007 mm -hmm. uh, when Barbara Morgan, uh, Idaho's teacher in space, finally got into space. Uh, and every, every year since then, we've been having a week-long event at the Discovery Center to keep people up to date on what's going on with activities in space through NASA, getting to meet other astronauts and uh, hear very interesting things about uh, science and technology and what's going on in space. That's great. Now, what are some of the exhibits that we can look forward to seeing during Space Days? Well, uh, we have a spacesuit right here. Now, this spacesuit is actually a mock-up because uh, the real thing weighs over 300 pounds. Wow. Uh, and the white suits like this are worn by those astronauts that do what they call extravehicular or EVA activities. Uh, when you see a picture of an astronaut wearing an orange suit, that right. means that their job is inside the space shuttle or inside the International Space Station. But for exhibits that we'll have set up, we have things like this, mm -hmm. uh, and we have uh, a NASA education specialist, Tony Levitt, coming to town for four of our six days this year. And by the way, our, our events run from uh, Friday, August 5th through Wednesday, August 10th. And Tony will be there for four of those days. He's an extremely interesting and entertaining guy, and he brings lots of uh, good show and tell items. For the younger kids, we set up tables of activities throughout the facility. Mm -hmm. uh, for the entire family, we do model rocket launches every day out on the right. lawn. Uh, and those are a lot of fun as well. That's cool. And you're also going to have astronauts in addition to Barbara Morgan there, correct? That is correct. Uh, on the first day of Space Days, uh, we'll have Jose Hernandez coming to Boise and speaking at 3 o'clock. Uh, he'll talk about his experiences uh, coming from a migrant farm community in California to becoming an astronaut. Uh, he and Barbara, after Jose's presentation, will sit down and, and uh, sign pictures and meet the public. And on the last day of the event, we have John Harrington, so that would be Wednesday, August 10th. And uh, John is a Native American. Uh, in fact, I think he's the only Native American astronaut that had worked for NASA. Mm -hmm. And anyway, um, John's a very interesting guy. He will also talk about his uh, younger years uh, and how he became an astronaut. And then John's actually the one that's going to be hosting, the, there's a VIP day, right? That is correct. Uh, we are working with Living Social. We're mm -hmm. trying something brand new. Uh, if you go to the home page of our website, which is dcidaho.org, mm -hmm. uh, there's a link right there to the Living Social page where they are selling family packages uh, for the 10th. And part of that package is uh, an exclusive meeting with John uh, after his event. Wow. And uh, other things included in that package are a signed poster by Barbara Morgan, some mm -hmm. space food to take home, <laughs> a discount in our science store, and a meal is included, um, a dinner is included with that package as well. And then they also get an actual meet and greet with, uh, with John, yeah. correct? Yeah. Uh, so we can take pictures, autographs, everything else, yes. and really ask him questions face to face. And yes. It's a chance to meet a real live astronaut. Yes, it is. That's really cool. Now, all this is going on on top of the standard stuff that you have going on at the Discovery Center right now. As well, correct? That's correct. Uh, gyrations, which opened in June, mm -hmm. uh, we don't move any of those things out. We just keep everything in place and we just fit in all of the Space Days activities around our existing exhibits. So it's a real bonus in addition to the just general admission fees that are going on. Yeah. In fact, uh, you, for, for all the Space Days activities, it's covered under our general admission. Um, we do have outside activities, as I mentioned, the model rocket launches, which are fun and fascinating mm -hmm. and learn how to build your own model rockets. Those outside events are actually free of charge for people that just want to come and see those events. That sounds great. Well, we really appreciate the heads up there, Doug. So it's Space Days going on August 5th through the 10th over at the Discovery Center. And for more information, they can just check out your website again, which is dcidaho.org. And then you can also find the Living Social link to get a great deal to meet an astronaut, spend some time with them there. That's true, and you can also print a full listing of activities uh, from our website. Awesome. Well, Doug, we wish you all the best and have a far out time. All right. <laughs> Stick around. More ETV coming up next.